what is occurring right now with the, with the Steam It platform is that there is no censorship because there is no uh, higher authority that censors everybody. There's no Google out there trolling uh, the community to make sure that uh, there's not speech that needs to be censored. There's, there's none of that. There's no centralized censorship figure. But what there, what there is on Steemit are people. There are people that in everybody, every single person has downvoting powers, but that downvoting power is magnified by reputation, meaning that if you have a reputation score that's in the 70s, you pretty much can downvote the entire platform, almost the entire platform, right? If you have, if you get up to the 70 reputation score, you're pretty much saying that you have power over 90%, at least 90% of the Steam It community. So if you don't like somebody because of their skin color, boom, you can downvote them. You don't like somebody because of their political opinion, boom, you could downvote them. You don't like somebody because they're involved in an interracial relationship, boom, you could downvote them. And then you could follow these people and you can downvote, 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 and downvote. And, and literally to the point where you can arbitrarily kick someone out of the Steam It platform simply because you kept red flagging and red flagging and red flagging them because of your animus, whether that's based on racial animus or ethnic animus or societal animus or whatever it is, whatever dark hearted nature that, that exists that is causing this, the people with reputation, high, extremely high reputation scores, they inherently have the power to dictate how the entire network moves. That's a very frightening concept. Very frightening. That is just way too much power centralized towards people that have no credentials, that have no authority, that have no inherent authority to make these calls. And I've seen firsthand that these calls are very arbitrary and often very discriminatory towards one particular person or towards certain individuals and not affecting other individuals. There is no clear platform. There is no clear guideline. There's no clear mandate on the downvoting process. And that is why we tell it, our fellow Steemians, please don't use the downvote unless it is under an extreme circumstance, number one, and number two, that it is directly impacting you. Don't downvote on behalf of somebody else. I mean, you know, like it has to, number one, be an extreme case, and number two, it has to impact you somehow. You have to be the victim in order to uh, downvote, for example. Otherwise, we're creating this, this monster where we're trusting total strangers to have a, a certain sense of ethics, to have a moral compass. But again, how is that moral compass defined for individuals? We simply don't know. And that is why if you have a censored platform, like Steam it is a censored platform, it is far better to have that censorship power uh, focalized, centralized towards, towards an agency that is transparent, that makes their rulings transparent, that makes their uh, their procedures transparent. Otherwise, you're going to have way too many individuals with disparate agendas attacking each other and downvoting each other and ultimately hurting the Steven network.